Uh, what's going on, guys? I'm going to stay in tune here for this one. Uh, this one's a shout out here for Gary. Always commenting, and always liking my vids. I appreciate it, man. Hope this helps you out here. Uh, this is going to be the intro that you requested for I've Just Seen a Face by the Beatles. So uh, you're going to start out here. Um, I see a lot of guys teaching hybrid picking here where you're going to use the pick, but you're also going to be using your, uh, in this case, your ring finger on your right hand. Uh, you don't necessarily need to. You can just use the pick if you need to. There's only one little part where you can do it in the beginning, but you can kind of just do that if you want to. But I'll show you right now. So you're going to start out, hit the open A string. Then you're going to come with the fourth fret on the E string. That's how you start. And then we get into this little hybrid pick thing here. So you're going to start out with your fourth fret on the D string. I'm using my ring finger on the left hand. And you're going to bar the second fret with the lower strings. So you're gonna start hit. So hit the D with the pick, D string, fourth fret. And then with your ring finger, you can hit up those other strings. And you do it three times on each. So it's gonna be like this. And then if you can't do the hybrid picking, you can just do. Just do the D and the E strings. Okay? And then from there on, you're gonna take your middle finger and slide it to the sixth fret. And then you're gonna have your index finger on the fifth fret on the E. And it's gonna be the same thing, three on each. So, so far we got. Okay? And from there, you're gonna slide from the 6th fret to the 11th fret on the G, and the 9th fret on the E. Just threes again. Okay. And then from 11th fret G to the 14th fret on the G, and you're gonna have your pinky and the 14th fret on the E. Threes again. Okay. And then you're gonna go from there back to the G on the 11th fret on the and then 10th fret on the E string three times again and then you're going to slide it to the 12th fret G 12th fret E three times again go to the 14th fret on the G and E and on this time you're actually going to do six times Okay, so that's the only time it's not three. Then you're gonna go back to the 13th fret on the G, 12th fret on the E, three times, and then slide it back to 11 and 10. So 11 on the G, 10 on the E, three times. Goes back into the A. So again. slow again sorry so again that first part is the only time you really need to do the hybrid picking if you want to get those other notes in there if you don't want to or can't you can just do if you want to do that if you can't do the hybrid picking but I'm doing hybrid picking just for this part because it does sound a little bit better That's all of it. So there it is. Um, if you have any questions, Gary, go drop them in the comments. Anybody else watching this have any questions, drop them in the comments. I'll get to them. I'll try to break it down a little bit more simple if you need me to. 
Um, I did kind of go quick, but uh, if if you listen to just each time, each one that I tell you changed you, it'll work. It's weird. It's a little different. It's cool though. And that's just the intro there for you guys. So again, any questions, drop in the comments. Appreciate you, Gare. Hope this helps you out. Thank you guys for watching.